The tension is palpable and you can understand why. Two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. They are the two foremost teams in Spanish football, Real Madrid and Barcelona, and they're getting ready to face each other here at the Bernabeu. My name's Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. Stuart, can't wait for this one. No, nor can I, Derek. They don't come any bigger than this, do they? The two giants of Spanish football. The atmosphere is incredible inside this stadium. Let's hope we see a top-class game as well. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Nacho Fernandez plays with Antonio Rudiga in central defence. Toni Kroos plays alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Frenkie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And the starting role and attack today is handed to Robert Lewandowski. Well, Vinicius Junior is the sort of player who wears his heart on his sleeve. We can tell that he enjoys playing this great game. What do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. Rodrigo. Here's Cavajal. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Just wasn't going to part with the ball. Might work out. And Bellingham. Now with Valverde. And return to Vinicius. And a fine stop. Now how about the short corner? Rodrigo. Now with course. Textbook defending inside the box. Frankie de Jong. It's with Joao Cancelo. Oriol Romeu. Joao Felix. And an astute piece of defending. Mendy. Vinicius Jr. And on to Bellingham. Well, nothing to split the two sides, but this move looks promising. Well, good effective pressure. Gundogan. Here's Rafinha. It's with Gundogan. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. Felix. And he stopped them in their tracks. Rodrigo. Gundogan. Lewandowski. Now with De Jong. It's with Gundogan. Strong play here. Can he put it away? Splendid defending. Short corner it is. De Jong. Now with Gundogan. Strength and control, a big part of his game. 
And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. Well, he was one of the better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. Into the second half, then. And these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. Nacho Fernandez. Mendy has it. Mendy. Vinicius Junior. And oh, that's wonderful attacking play. It's got to be! And still danger here. Threat over for now, it seems. And a throw coming up after a really fine piece of tackling. Well, Real Madrid has certainly created opportunities to take the lead here, but that was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping to keep them at bay. Gundogan. Kunde Araujo He read the situation defensively and did his job Lewandowski Joao Felix Promising move from Barcelona Joao Felix Barcelona in their quest to take the lead might be helped out by this corner time for a change then it's a short corner Christensen and here's Joao Felix Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. Carvajal. Rudiger has it. Here's Carvajal. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. But then the one that fails to hit its target. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. What can Real do from this position? Valverde. On to course. Vinicius Junior. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Kunde. Here's Rafinha. Really closing him down. Decisive in the tackle. And a throw in here. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. It's come down to the final five minutes and still they're deadlocked at nil-nil. 
Ferran Torres. And it's with Inigo Martinez. Barcelona on the attack in the closing moments. Still level here. Well, Real have to score soon. Time is running out. But these fans can sense the winners coming. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And that is the whistle for the end of the 90. Nothing at all to separate these two. And so the penalty shootout about to commence. And as a player, and it's gone in. And the penalty converted here. Can he remain calm? And he scores. And the keeper makes the all-important save. What a big moment. And there it is, perfectly executed. And he finds the net he could hardly miss. Can he convert? And he's beaten the keeper. Well, the responsibility is on his shoulders. Failure to score, and they lose. So lethal in front of goal. Well, a successful kick here, and that will be that. A mountain of pressure on him, but he withstands the test, and they've gone and won it. Well, cool, composed, and really good technique. A match-winning...